video it is going to be a review and first impression of the Tarte Bestkin, Bestin False Lash Extending Fibers. Um, I'm actually really excited to try this. I have every stitch makeup on except for mascara, so let's just get in with the video. So, this retails for $20 at Sephora, um, and I believe it is available online. I picked this up in a store. Um, so, this kit comes with the best in the fibers and then a mini of the Lights Camera Lashes 4 in 1 mascara. I've actually never tried this, so it's a first impression on both, I guess. So the instructions say, first apply one coat of Lights Camera Lashes 4 in 1 mascara, wedging the wand at the base of the lashes and pulling through it to the tip. So I'm going to do that now. Okay, so the brush is like a standard mascara wand, obviously. Um, and I personally don't see any difference with this mascara. Maybe there's not any product in the brush. Um... That's a bit odd. Okay, there it goes. Um, I'm just trying to get all of my lashes first. I don't know actually how well this is going to work, partly because I do have ridiculously short, thin eyelashes. So this might work well, or it might not, depending on, um... So, I'm going to just do the other eye now. Okay, now my eyelashes are coated in one coat of the uh, Lights Camera Lashes. I'm not actually a big fan of this mascara. I personally don't like see any difference. It might change. It's obviously going to change once I put the last lash fibers on. Um, yeah, it doesn't look like my eyelashes are coated in anything. But now it says the second step is coat the lash brush entirely with the black fibers starting at the outer corner of the eye gently combing comb the fibers onto lashes from the base upward to the tip repeat this motion working towards the inner corner until lashes are coated with a thin layer of fibers finish with a final coat of lights camera lashes four in one mascara to set and seal the fibers in place so i'm going to do that now um oh okay that's a little bit different obviously you, I don't think you guys will be able to see that, but it's like, that is interesting. Okay, so, I'm still seeing no difference. Okay, now I'm kind of seeing it. Oh my god. It looks like I'm wearing a pair of false eyelashes. That is so cool. Okay. Going once more. Um, I kind of wish I did just a second coat of the uh, Light Camera Lashes mascara just because, um, that would have just made my eyelashes a little bit more black. But this is so cool. Okay. This is making my eyelashes really long. You guys won't be obviously be won't be able to tell unfortunately because I do have short eyelashes, but okay. There goes the fiber. 
Um, this obviously wouldn't be something you would want to put on your bottom eyelashes, in my opinion. But, okay. So I'm done with that eye. I'm just going to seal it with a coat of the Lights Camera Lashes. Yeah, still not a fan of this mascara, to be honest. But it will do. Okay. Now on, I'm going to do the same thing with the fibers, but on the other eye. The seam that I got a fiber in my eye. Okay, that hurts. Oh well. After doing this eye, I honestly don't see a difference. Um, but let's just do the one coat. Okay, so I can't even focus really right now. I personally think after doing this, this is personally not worth the money. I wouldn't spend the $20 just because it, I don't see any difference, uh, personally. But that might just be because I have short eyelashes and the mascara was kind of dried up and gross. But, I mean... It may not work for me, but it may work fantastic for you. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that red subscribe button because I will be doing a uh, giveaway once I hit 100 subscribers. So stay tuned for that, and I will talk to you all in my next video. Bye, guys.